then, where would you rate yourself on kindness? How kind are you, Diana? 9.5%. 9.5, that's pretty kind. Nick, what about you? Probably a 9%. Well, 9? 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10, yeah, okay, pretty good. Miss Wilson, how about you? Oh, I'm going to say an 8 and give myself room to grow. How about you, sir? Uh, I'd like to think I was a 10, but uh, maybe I'll be modest and say, yeah, an 8 too, because I think it's good to try to think about the future and what you can do better. Do you know that you show respect to others when you're kind to them? So this week, we're going to encourage you to say something kind to someone in your home. So think about who you would be kind to and what you would say. Yeah, everybody needs a kind word. Find somebody at home that you can give that kind word to. So Diana, who would you speak to at home and what would you say? My mum, she's always cooking me dinner and letting me go out for, to the park and stuff. Oh, cooking you dinner, letting you do things like going to the park. Nick, how about you? Who would you choose to say something kind to at home? I'd probably say something kind to my nan because whenever she comes over to my house, she cooks a great pork crackle. <laughs> Pork crackle, no wonder you've got kindness to say to her. Those are terrific examples. So be respectful at home and at school. Demonstrate kindness to demonstrate empathy. And remember, being kind to people doesn't just make them feel good, it also makes you feel good. Yeah, we've been pretty lucky this week. We've been able to use this space in the primary school, the music room, very generous of Mrs Collier to let us uh, film our challenge here this week. Diana, is there anything you'd like to say to her? Thank you, Miss Conrad. That was very kind of you. You are most welcome. Have a musical week. Mm -hmm.